earlier, I told you how you can add a link to your dock to a website of your favorites or whatever by merely dragging the icon right, found right here to the dock. Now that's all well and good, but if you do that to all of your web favorite websites, then they'll look the same. See, that one looks the same as that one. I'll have to read the text. So that one says blog, and that one says YouTube. Well, you can become a bit more efficient if you follow this tip. To start off, I'm going to get rid of these. You want to drag the icon to your desktop. Okay? I don't need that anymore. I'm going to drag this icon to our desktop. Drag it there. And now I want to rename these to just YouTube. YouTube. And this one to Blogger. Now, if I drag this to my dock, there we go, we have the link. But it's uh, a weird looking sim weird looking icon, and we don't want that. So, what we'll do is we'll get some icons for it. I've already downloaded some. And let's check what we have. We'll open these up. Okay, we'll start with YouTube first. I'll select all and copy it. And I'll go to my desktop, hit Command I, click on this icon right here, and paste it. I'll close that, and I can drag this into my dock, and it's a lot easier to see that that one's YouTube. I'll do the same for Blogger, select all, copy, hit Command I, or you can do Command Option I. I'll show the inspector, and we want to just select Blogger. I want to click on the icon, press Paste. There we go. I'm going to close this and quit preview. Now, I can click on these and it will take me to the web page in Safari. But the problem is, is if I delete the original files, these two files right here, they won't work anymore. So what, I've, well, so what I'll do is I'll go to my sites, Mac Tipper, uh, sites. I'll create a new one called Doc Links. It's just a handy place to put it. You can put it anywhere you want, but I'll put it in my sites folder. I'll drag it there, and now they're in a nice place so I can get them anytime. If I have to, I can delete them, whatever. But still, I can click on them, and it'll open up that web page. So, check it out, and use it if you want to.